Welcome to FBLA PBL's webinar designed to provide you tips on how your chapter can use professional division members to help your chapter excel. My name is Lisa Smothers and I serve as the membership director for FBLA PBL and I'll be introducing today's guest speakers. I'll also be serving as a moderator when we get to the question and answer session. We encourage you to submit questions at any time during the broadcast using the GoToWebinar toolbar at the top right of your screen. We'll go over questions at the end of this presentation. We're delighted to welcome two professional division national officers to this afternoon's presentation. David Jones, your professional division national president, has a rich FBLA PBL history. He was a former Maryland FBLA PBL state officer, has been a professional division member since 2008, where he has also served as the national vice president and he is chairman of the Maryland FBLA PBL Board of Directors. Kelly Scholl, your Professional Division National Secretary Treasurer, is a lifelong supporter of FBLA PBL. She was an active FBLA and PBL member, served as an FBLA advisor for 15 years, and currently serves as the North Dakota FBLA PBL State Chair. Now I'll turn it over to David Jones. David, you're up. Thanks, Lisa. FBLA PBL has four divisions, and we like to say that with our organization, you can have a lifetime association by starting in the middle level and then continuing through FBLA, PBL, and finally the professional division. There are opportunities to get involved at all levels of FBLA PBL. Your FBLA or PBL chapter is one of many activities sponsored by your school. You can keep your school's officials and administrators involved in your activities and supportive of them by targeting them to become members of the professional division. Once they become members, ask them to attend your regular meetings or to serve as an official in an officer or new member induction ceremony. As your chapter activities grow, keep school officials informed of your progress and success. Make your chapter available to support and assist school officials whether it be by creating programs for sporting events or providing members to help out at school events throughout the year. Who can join? Anybody, a former member, employers, educators, parents, business people, community supporters. Basically anyone who has an interest in FBLA, PBL can become a professional division member. Dues for one year membership are $25 Per year with the exception of California where they're 30. Every time a, per a person joins the professional division through a chapter that school gets credit. When a chapter recruits many professional division members they have a chance to win recognition on the state and national levels. Just like the other divisions professional members also plan their activities around the three words on our crest service education and progress. Professional division members are eager to serve your chapter by being members of an advisory council where they meet with your advisor and officers and offer advice for competition and activities. They can offer educational opportunities by having resume critique sessions, offer your chapter member tour chapter members tours of their business, or even help by providing job shadowing experiences. Most importantly, they can help advisors and members stay up to date on the most current business trends. Our members can offer your chapter so many things that will enhance a member's experience, whether it be by mentoring students for a competitive event such as business plan, creating networking opportunities between students and business leaders, offering, offering career advice, or even providing scholarships and financial support for students to attend state and national leadership conferences. Professional members often serve as a liaison between business and the classroom, share real life experiences at meetings and workshops, provide professional development training through workshops, and arrange tours of local businesses. You can ensure the continued involvement of professional members once they are recruited by sending a letter of appreciation for every major activity that they help complete. Promote your professional division members in local and state newsletters and on your website. 
Now I'd like to turn it over to Kelly, who will talk about ways to engage PD members in your local chapter. Thanks, David. You can engage with your professional division members at any time during the year, but in particular, I'd like to focus on some things that you could do during FBLA PBL week, which will be February 8th through the 14th. For instance, you could designate one day as professional division or PD engagement day. This day would be designed to encourage chapter members and advisors to connect with their professional members and their business leaders. This would be a good opportunity to connect with those business leaders and faculty that your chapter has already recruited into the professional division, and it also offers chapters additional ways to recruit new members from the community who can help your chapter, whether it be by speaking at a chapter meeting or helping students prepare for state and national competitions. Many chapters offer business leaders who speak at chapter meetings a gift membership in the professional division. Some chapters sponsor a networking lunch with business professionals or an after-school session with local community leaders. Other activities, a great chapter event would be to tour the local business of one of your professional division or alumni members or to have chapter officers meet with community officials or state legislators. Getting ready for competition by having professional members conduct mock job interview sessions with your chapter competitors for state competition and job interview or future business executive would be another way to engage with your professional division members. Other ideas for chapter projects during this day during FBLA PBL week would be to contact your professional members and business leaders to arrange job, shout job shadowing opportunities for your members, perhaps have them host a career day, or create that business advisory council for your chapter which would allow your professional division members to give input to your chapter. Professional Division or PD Engagement Day is a perfect time to sponsor a community service project and get professional members to help with that. Perhaps you can help them with a business project that they are interested in. Many chapters sponsor workshops and have professional division members actually review student resumes and give constructive critiques. Why not use those professionals who are actually in business and know what employers are looking for in employees? Finally, this would be a great time to also get your members, professional members, and alumni involved with the community by talking about the benefits of FBLA PBL and the chapter successes at a local city council meeting or a school board meeting. The more you get the word out about FBLA and PBL, the more support your chapter will gain when they're looking for help with funding. And I'm going to turn it back over to David. Thank you, Kelly. Please don't hesitate to contact any of your professional division national officer team members for advice on how to connect with or utilize professional division members. We are here to help. Your team consists of myself and Kelly, as well as National Vice President Blake Reynolds from Massachusetts. Okay, we had a number of questions submitted during the presentation and we'll start getting to those now. If we run out of time, we'll email you individually to answer any question that we're not able to get to. So the first question is from Isabel from Oklahoma. She would like some tips for recruiting professional division members for her local chapter. David, this one's for you. Okay, great. Thank you, Isabel. There are many ways for uh, to recruit professional division members for your local chapter, and one of the main things that I would like to uh, draw your attention to is the recruiting resources section on our website. Uh, if you go to the National FBLA website and go under professional division, there will be a, a tab called recruiting resources. And under that tab, there are many things, many templates uh, to send out to recruit members as well as just general recruiting ideas. So that's a good resource. We also have uh, a membership video to uh, help recruit professional division members there. Also, I'd encourage you to consider having an open house with your chapter uh, where you invite potential members in, sending out newsletters to businesses in your community, utilizing social media, and uh, promoting the membership discounts and other incentives that we offer um, that are on our website. 
Thanks, David. Those are all great tips. The next question comes from Lucy from Virginia. She has five new professional division members and would like to know how she can work with them to help her local chapter become more successful. Uh, Kelly, can you take this one? Sure. Thanks, Lisa. Uh, that's a great question, Lucy, and if you've gone out and recruited five new professional division members, great job. Um, I would say utilize the expertise of your professional division members. So if one of them works in human resources, use them to perhaps critique resumes before they're submitted for the job interview or the future business um, leader competitions. Use them to help prepare for those interviews. Um, if you have somebody who works in marketing or the IT area, they can help prepare students for the role play portion of those competitions. You can also utilize your new professional division members to help students explore careers or to um, look at possible interests. So maybe you want to utilize them to job shadow um, or bring them in to speak to your chapter members about the field that they work in. You can also use them to gather fundraising ideas. Um, many professional members have connections to um, charitable organizations and they may lead you into a community service project for your chapter. Um, and put those um, professional division members to use by adding them to or developing an advisory council for your chapter and if you meet with them you know a few times a year they can just offer so much advice and bring fresh ideas to your chapters activities and help you develop your program of activities. Great. The next question comes from Cole in Georgia, and he's saying with FBLA PBL week coming up in February, his chapter is working on planning activities now. He wants to know how he can involve his local chapter professional members. David, can you help us out with this question? Absolutely. Thank you, Cole. Uh, there, really, the opportunity to involve a professional division member is it's limitless. Uh, some of the main ways that professional division members uh, do uh, help a chapter or get involved with a local chapter. Uh, like Kelly just mentioned, serving on a business advisory council for your chapter um, is a really great way to improve your uh, improve the performance of your local chapter, but also to utilize the resources or the expertise of the professional division member. They also provide teaching and uh, mentoring of our members. They can create great networking opportunities, provide career advice, uh, along the lines of a career, they can uh, offer internships and job shadowing opportunities, and they can even be uh, relied on for financial support for a sponsorship, maybe of a competitive event or to get to a state or national conference. Uh, and lastly, think about using them to help you prepare for competitive events. A lot of times professional division members are the judges at state and national conferences, so uh, why not get to them early? have them uh, critique you and provide feedback that way. Thanks, David. Um, Susan is a professional member from Florida, and she's a new professional member, and she'd like to know what chapters are near her and how she can get involved not only at the local level but at the state level as well. Uh, Kelly, can you help her out with this? Sure. Susan, first of all, welcome to the professional division. We're glad to have you as a member. The first thing I think you need to do is um, get in contact with the Florida FBLA PBL State Advisor. I happen to know that her name is Jody Jones and to connect with her, two suggestions. You could either contact Lisa Smothers at the National Office. Um, her contact information is at fbla-pbl.org or you can search the Florida, search the internet for the Florida website to contact um, that person. From there, the Florida State Advisor can determine which chapters are closest to you and she can help connect you to the local chapter advisor and their members. As far as the second part of your question, how you can get involved at the local and state level, um, you know, in the previous questions we've talked about a lot of ways that that can happen, but help help members com prepare for their competitive events, speak to their chapter about your profession, um, offer job shadowing opportunities, um, if you're involved with a service organization maybe connect the two. Um, 
serve on a local chapter advisory council, that sort of thing. And at the state level, I think the most important thing that you could do is to help out at the state leadership conference that's held every spring. Um, they always need judges, people who can, you know, help judge and evaluate the competitors and then perhaps even um, offer workshops at the state leadership conference. Great, those are all great, great suggestions, Kelly. We just had another question come in. This one's from Tony from Illinois, and he's part of his local chapter recruitment committee. Right now, they're focusing on recruiting professional members. He wants to know what he could say to someone to try to convince them to join the professional division. David, can you give him some tips for this? Absolutely. I would say for a professional division member, uh, uh, one of the biggest selling points to me uh, is it's a immediate access to the next generation of business leaders. As a professional division member, you have the ability to help shape that the future workforce and leaders. Uh, you can get involved by getting involved with that local chapter today. And there are so many intrinsic rewards that come along uh, with mentoring young leaders that it's just a, a selling point in and of itself. And you will build lifelong friendships and relationships by being able to network with other PD members from around the country. Um, that along with all the other benefits that are listed on our website, I just, you know, that ability to hit, to be in that close contact with the next generation coming up uh, is, I would say, the biggest selling point for a potential professional division member. I'd have to agree with that. Um, looks like we're out of questions. I'll just wait a few seconds. Are there any other questions coming in? Okay. Looks like, we, uh, again, the, we don't have any more questions, so I'd like to thank everyone for their participation today, and I hope you have a great rest of the week. Thank you.